So hi traders, very good evening. Uh, the purpose of making this video to discuss three topics today. First topic I'm going to discuss about this post market analysis. So yesterday trade plan versus today achievement details I'm going to show you. And second topic I'm going to discuss about this uh, uh, trade plan for this tomorrow. So Nifty Bank Nifty. So important liquidity location and with the trade plan also I'm going to discuss. And third topic I'm going to discuss is tomorrow is expiry is there. So I'm going to discuss about this uh, zero to hero game plan. So these are the three topics I'm going to discuss in this video. Uh, before going to this uh, uh, post-market analysis and coming to this trade plan, is this trade plan is going to work more than 80% of the accuracy. But only thing is that we need to uh, wait for this right location and right candlestick patterns. So then only we are going to work this more than 80% of the accuracy. Uh, for first one year, uh, uh, trade plan versus achievement details is all on my Telegram channel. So in description, I'm sharing my Telegram channel link. And if you simply follow this trade plans, uh, uh, you can get monthly 1000 points of this bank nifty. So now let's uh, discuss about this uh, post market analysis. And before going to this video, don't forget to subscribe to the channel, kindly like it and kindly uh, share to your trading community. And before going to this uh, post market analysis, so what happened yesterday? So just see this uh, yesterday trade plan. So it's a 427, uh, the timeline is. So what I'm saying is, uh, see this. So this level, if any chances price closes above this R1 levels, so we are trying to travel up to this R2 levels, target would be R2 levels. Here is multiple uh, support is there. So this is a weekly pivot and this is a uh, pink line is a strong support zone and this is a R1 levels. So multiple support range around these levels. If any chances price closes above this level, so then higher chances to price reaches to R2 levels. So exactly it happens, see this. So price exactly take the support from this level. So after that, see a big bounce and price reaches exactly R2 levels. So after that, consolidation mode. So that's how this trade plan is going to work. And coming to this Nifty, Nifty is a big gap of opening. So there is no uh, trade plan is will work. So we are this trade plan is going to work uh, up to this R1 to R2 levels. So above this R, R2 levels is not going to work. Okay. So now let's discuss about this trade plan for this tomorrow. So first we need to check this uh, important liquidity locations. So already mark this trade zones. And these are the important liquidity location. This is a today's high, today's low, and this is a CPR range. Uh, so based on the situation, so first we need to check the CPR range. CPR range starting from this uh, 35, 9, 990 to 36030. It's so only 40 points of the CPR. So we can expect so tomorrow is a trending market. And apart from that, we need to check some important liquidity location. So this is a gap order. So today price is gap of opening. So we need to check with this gap order levels and this is the S1 levels and coming to this downside, this is a virgin CPR levels. So downside is a virgin CPR and gap orders is there and upside is nothing is there, uh, only weekly pivot is there. So based on this situation, we can plan our trade for this tomorrow. Uh, if any chances price closes above this gap up opening, closes above this uh, previous day high levels. So definitely we are looking for this uh, long opportunity and we can travel up to this. R2 levels. So this is the R1 levels. So try to understand data. So once price this uh, previous day high breakout and we are looking for this long opportunity and we can travel up to this R2 levels. So try to avoid this type of parabolic candles. So in the in any cases, this type of parabolic candle, so uh, wait for this price come for the retracement around this level. So with the confirmation candle, so we can travel up to this R2 levels. So this is the trade plan one and coming to this trade plan two. Uh, if any chances price closes, uh, flat opening and closes, uh, this breakout will happen. So this gap order breakout. So better to wait for this price again, come for this uh, uh, previous day, low levels. With the confirmation candle, we are going to take the trade decision and we can travel up to this S2 levels. So try to understand traders, once this previous day low breakout and this S1 breakout and this gap order breakout. So better to wait for this price come for this level. So once price come for this level, so then we can travel up to this S2 levels. So these are the two trade plan for this uh, bank nifty. Let's discuss about this nifty. So coming to this nifty, we need to check important liquidity locations. So this is a CPR range and today's high and today's low. And this is a gap order range. And downside is a virgin CPR. And this is one more gap order and one more virgin CPR. 
So downside is a, a back to back gap orders and virgin CPRs. And upside is, so let's check with this upside. So upside is nothing is there. Uh, this is only weekly POD is there. So based on the situation, we can plan our trade for this tomorrow. Uh, if any chances price uh, opening around this levels and once break this uh, previous day high breakout. So definitely we are looking for this long opportunities target would be this R2 levels. R2 levels are this weekly pivot levels. So check with the risk reward. Once match the uh, risk reward, then only you can go for this long opportunity. So coming to this downside, uh, if any chances flat opening and price once break out this S1 level, so definitely we are looking for this short opportunity. So we can travel up to this S2 levels. And uh, here is a, some uh, weekly pivot uh, is there around these levels. So we need to check this uh, levels also. So weekly pivot, uh, sometimes it may, we can expect some uh, bouncing from this level. So let's see. So once price break out, then price come for the retracement. Better to uh, do one thing traders. So in these cases, once this weekly pivot break out, then price come for this uh, retracement around this previous day low levels. So with the confirmation candle, then we can travel up to this S2 levels. So this is the S1 levels. And coming to this CPR range is very small range. So 16, 520, 52. Uh, 16, 541 is the only 15 fans of the CPR. So we can consider as a narrow CPR. So these are the two trade plans for this tomorrow. Okay. So now important topic uh, we are going to discuss about this uh, zero to hero game. So this is a zero to hero game. Uh, in this uh, first, uh, we need to understand this price action and this is going to activate zero to hero game. So you can activate around this 2 p.m. So after two o'clock, okay. If price is closer above these levels after two o'clock, okay, and we are going for this long opportunity, uh, thirty six two hundred. This is at the money call, call options thirty six one eighty. So that means it's thirty six two hundred. Uh, that time is after two o'clock is available uh, fifty two sixty rupees. Okay, so you just buy it and just leave it to the market. So we can expect some big movements. Okay, so maximum loss is only uh, twelve fifty rupees like that. Or if it is price is trading 80 rupees also, you just keep the stop loss of 30 rupees and just leave it to the market. Once you get the two hour, you can book the trade or you can trail with the trailing stop loss. So this is after 2 p.m. 2 p.m. buy with the at the money call option once break these levels. Okay. So coming to downside, uh, if any chances after 2 o'clock price closes below these levels, so definitely we are going for this short opportunity. And this range is a 35,900. Okay. So you can take this 35,900 put option. So after two o'clock, it would be trading around this 80 to 90 rupees. So you can keep the 50, uh, 50 pants of the stop loss. So that means is a, you can keep this uh, 40 uh, is a stop loss. Okay. If it is uh, 90, that the stop loss would be 40. If it is 80, in that case, stop loss would be 30. So you can keep this 50 pants of the stop loss and just leave it to the market. And we can expect some big movements for this tomorrow. Once either this break out this level or this levels. So we need to buy at the money call option and put option only after 2 p.m. If it is market is uh, uh, trading above this previous day high level, so you can buy call option. If any chances market trading below this previous day low level, so you can buy put option at the money put option and keep the 50 pants of the stop loss. And if it is 60 uh, trading around this 60, so just buy it and just leave it to the market. Okay. So that's how it's going to work. And uh, most of the times it's going to give this uh, uh, three hour or four hour returns, but check with the uh, risk reward. Once get the two hour, try to exit or you can trail with the stop loss. So that's how this uh, strategy is going to work. And this strategy try to apply only after 2 p.m. So that's it traders today. And I hope you're enjoying this video. So don't forget to subscribe the channel, kindly like it and kindly share it to your trading community. So the channel main objective is helping to retail and novice traders to become successful and professional traders. And for this uh, 50,000 ch capital challenge is going on for this uh, retail traders, so option buyers. So, so far is uh, given for this 35,000 uh, rupees of the profit. So that uh, will be continue for this further. Okay. Uh, if anyone interested, you just, uh, a WhatsApp me. Uh, so I'm given the my WhatsApp number in description. So in description, I'm sharing my Telegram channel link and WhatsApp details. Okay. So if you're having any doubts, please uh, let me know. So thank you very much traders. And uh, this is Ashok Gomera signing up and good night to all.